Deb. How Hi, are you? Ann. Hi. Hi. Welcome. Have you ever had reflexology before, Deb? I'm kind of new to it. Oh, good. Yeah. Well, it's so good to be here, Ann, and good. help the center and then receive at the same time. And um, though I'm not a breast cancer survivor, I'm just so glad that I can be here and uh, the proceeds do go to the breast cancer survivors so they can have the treatment that they need. Right. But let me, before I start, I'm going to tell you a little bit about reflexology. Okay. If you look at this little chart, it's actually your feet reflect your body. They're kind of a mirror of your body. Okay. And so if you look at the very top, your big toe reflects your head. And from there it goes down with your other toes to your shoulders that we're going to treat. From the lateral side of your foot, we're going to go down to your um, shoulders, your waist, your hips, and then the inner part of your foot is your spine area. We're going to go right down your spine. Okay. Then we also go and treat on the foot itself. Oh, look at that. Yeah. We'll hit your glands and your organs, so to speak. So at the top, you've got your heart and your lungs, and then we go down your stomach, your liver, your pancreas and then your colon, your intestines, and your sciatica. It's very beneficial, not just for the public, but as well as the cancer patients, because as we treat men and women now here at the center, they'll find as they're going through cancer treatment, it's very stressful for yeah. many aspects. I, yes. Um, yeah. So you're, the benefits of reflexology are gonna help reduce that stress. That what you made need. you get into opening the center, Ian? Well, um, I am a breast cancer survivor, okay. two years out, and um, I was fortunate to be able to have an hour of this treatment of reflexology and massage every week during all my treatment. Wow. And I knew how beneficial it was. So we're going to do what we call um, dessert or relaxation mm, treatment. That feels good. And your goal is to just relax, relax. and uh, enjoy. So when you're all done, you can rest a little bit and drink a lot of water because there'll be toxins moving through your body that we need to make sure move through. I'm going to go down your spine when I work this side of your foot. So I'm going right down and each time I do a pressure like this, I'm working right down your back. So we usually go over the point about three times. Now where did you get your training? My training was done by one of the better uh, reflexologists in the state of Maine, Myra Acorn in Augusta. And I went from February till May of this year and uh, did the classes and then completed the test. And then I had to do 20, hour, 20 people three times for a total of 250 hours of class in order wow. to get certified. Yeah. So I finished that in um, August 28th. Oh, that's great. Well, congratulations. Thanks. And, you know, the neat thing is coming here and being able to have something done to myself for relaxation because I don't have cancer, but being able to spend this money and, and um, give it to another cancer patient. Yeah. The cancer patients, um, they, if they do decide uh, they want to use our services, they just need to get a note from their oncologist or their doctor to give us permission, and we will give them eight um, sessions an hour each of reflexology free and then they'll get also eight sessions of massage for an hour free. I just want to make sure everything's going okay as far as your treatment here with the reflexology and massage. Have you found it beneficial in helping you through this? Absolutely. Good. Um, as a cancer patient, um, cancer takes a toll on your body, mm. it, physically, mentally, and I know that when I'm coming here, I'm going to leave here feeling fabulous. Good. At least better than I felt when I came. Good. Which, you know, as a cancer patient, you have so many different appointments. Right. Um, doctors, you know, getting Absolutely. poked with needles. Yeah. Um, and this is just an appointment that you come to knowing that it's going to make you feel better right. when you leave. Right. So it's just a time that you can, well, for me, it's a time that I escape. Right. You yeah. take a little vacation with I your do. mind and body. <laughs> Good. I That's do. That's goal. Yeah. Yes. And um, right. if I come here and I want to not just get the reflexology and massage quietly, mm -hmm. I know that I can talk right. to both of you and Denise. Um, 
you being a survivor yourself right. of cancer, mm -hmm. I know that you understand what I've been through. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And can relate. And Denise, you know, massaging cancer patients for many, many years. Right. I can also talk to her, or I can just be quiet on the table if I want to. Exactly. <laughs> Whatever you need that day yes. is what we want to provide. Hi, my name is Denise Morin, and I've been an oncology massage therapist for 20 years. And I am so honored and privileged to work with cancer patients because it brings the good piece of cancer to them, if, if you can actually believe that. It allows them to de-stress and it allows them to just be, come here and have a retreat from cancer, just to let it go. And I'm, I'm happy and I'm so, again, blessed to do this work. So are you ready, Tammy? I am ready. Come on in. <laughs> I believe massage for the cancer patient makes them feel less alone. It de-stresses them, not only of the body, but of their mind and their soul. It allows them to come in and just be, to forget about cancer. It brings them to a place of calmness. If they want to talk, they can talk. If they want to cry, they can cry. They're the boss, I say, not me. They do whatever they want to do during this time. It's a very spiritual time. Again, I think oncology massage is working their spirit and they teach me about the depth of the human spirit. As with cancer, they have to keep going into onto different levels. This is a an appointment that they actually look forward to. The biggest benefit to oncology massage is that it's non-invasive. I love them up like my own. And they feel that love and that healing. So I'm so honored to be part of that journey with them, with each and every one of them. Besides the program, the reflexology and the massage here at the Wellness Center, we have some other programs outside of here that will help uh, as far as, um, you know, allowing you to do different things besides your cancer treatment. And that is we have art classes with Nell Ely, who's a local artist who does fantastic things with us at um, various programs. And then we have a great gift of Nan Brett, who owns the ballroom, the exercise and dance studio in Harrison, Maine. And Nan has gone and gotten certified through the American Cancer Society, and she can now provide um, cancer exercise programs for our patients. And she will do that free on Wednesday evenings. If you get in touch with us, we can tell you when those programs are, but those are free to cancer patients. And we also have a breast cancer support group that re meets once or twice a month. And that's a great group of women who really get together and uh, have a great time and be able to discuss openly different concerns they might have. And we will have various seminars with the naturopathic doctors who helped me immensely through my cancer treatment um, and gave alternative treatment to help the side effects. They'll be talking at various times, so again, get in touch with us if you need their assistance or want to hear about their programs. And as you check our website, again, at www.oneagleswings2.com, you'll see the various programs we offer throughout the seasons and the year to help you. <music>